Overnight, charges have been filed in a gruesome killing in Bucks County. A man was found decapitated in a home. Police took his son into custody 100 miles away, and they believe there was more to this murder than just a family grudge. Action News reporter Corey Davis is live in Middletown Township with more on this story now gaining national attention, Corey. Matt, good morning. This is a disturbing story, and I just spoke with one of the Middletown Township captains out here who tells me 32 year old Justin Moan was arraigned by video. He faced a judge by video and was denied bail earlier this morning. We are right now here at the scene where he lived. This is the 100 block of Upper Orchard Drive in Middletown Township. Want to show you a new photo there that we have of Justin Moan. He is accused of not only beheading his father, but also posting the video of him committing the act to YouTube. Moan is facing first degree murder as well as another charge that includes abuse of a corpse. Take a look at this video, a map of where he was located. We're told that he was arrested at Fort Indian Gap in Lebanon County, about 100 miles away. The, there is a National Guard training base there, and on that, on the base's website, it's referred to as America's busiest National Guard training center. It is unclear why Moan was in that area. Middletown Township Police say this took a, a collaborative effort to track him down. I think the neighborhood can, can rest easy because I think they were a little uneasy for a while before they knew where the person of interest was. And so I walk you through this. This all started around 7 o'clock last night after a gruesome discovery inside the home along the 100 block of Upward Orchard Drive here in Middletown Township. Initial dispatch reports uh, saying that a man in his 60s was found beheaded and covered in blood. Police have not released the name of that victim but said the father and son lived inside the home. The, uh, the YouTube video showing the decapitation was viewed at least 5,000 times before being taken down. In that video, Action News discovered that Moan referred to himself as a militia leader and called his father a traitor to the country for being a federal employee for 20 years. Moan spoke about President Joe Biden and threatened multiple federal agencies in that YouTube video. And also, too, we've learned through court documents that his preliminary or his uh, preliminary hearing will be held next Thursday on February 8th. We will definitely stay on top of the latest developments over the course of the morning and have reached out to investigators about whether he could face additional charges. Reporting live here in Middletown Township, Corey Davis, Channel 6 Action News. Yeah, a lot to unpack there. Corey, thank you for that update.